Assalamu alaikum. This video explains two terms, self-energizing and self-locking break, which I forget to explain in my first breaking video. But here it is. These terms are not only for single block break, rather it is for almost all types of mechanical breaks. We know the mechanism of brakes. We apply force on lever and shoe provides friction to the wheel. And this is the normal configuration or setting or condition of brake. This condition is known as self-energizing brake. Hold on, hold on. You might be like. The next term will clear your concepts even better. In the self-locking condition, we don't have to apply external force for the application of the brake. It means the external force P must be zero in expression and brake will be always in working state and offering friction to the wheel all the time, which is an undesirable condition. So when you design brake, keep in mind that it should be self-energizing, not self-locking.